Welcome back to Great Day Washington. It's time for the real deal in real estate. We've got our real deal team, Josh Green, president of Eastern Title and Settlement, Chong Yi of the Yi team at Caliber Home Loans, and Jackie Daly joining us today of Jackie Daly Realty. Welcome, Jackie. Nice to have you on Great Day. Thank Good you. to see you guys. Hey, Good Christian. morning. And I look forward to our weekly visits. <laughs> um, we are talking about rental properties today and why for some people that are iffy of if they want a rental property, uh, they should go for and Jackie I love what you say rental properties can be better than a man that's very true and there's Explain some that to us. <laughs> <laughs> there's some very good reasons for that if held a long time real estate always becomes more valuable over time you can hold a man forever and he's, his value may not increase <laughs> there you go Chuck <laughs> Your value is depreciating as we go on. Every single day, Josh. <laughs> Every single day. <laughs> also, with, also with properties, you can change a property by gutting a kitchen, adding a deck, but millions of, William, millions of women ahead of you can tell you that it's pretty much impossible to change a man. Real estate has tax deductions, whereas men can simply tax you. Bourbon and flat screen TD, TV simply are not tax deductible. Chong's like, why are we, what? wait, <laughs> did we know? No, but you're- but I'm there, sweating over there. I, I know. think the heater is on. Can I we know. put the AC on? It, it's, it's a great analogy because it's so visual we can understand it. Um, but why with rental properties though, even more so, it just seems to a lot of people like such a big expense and they already have a primary home and then maybe a rental property stays vacant for a while. So how do they benefit from that? You, you know, one of the things is my mom, she's, an older woman, she's in her 60s, and she bought a rental property, and she owns it free and clear, but every month she gets $1,200 a month. Mm -hmm. And you know, that's extra money. And even if she doesn't have it rented for three or four months, she just had a tenant in there for three years. She got $36,000. Actually, rental properties you know? really are Prince Charming because they do deliver cash flow each month, mm -hmm. so you are. Um, also, the tenants are making the payment for you. No mutual fund, no one's making the payment for you on that. So the tenants are making the payment, paying that investment off for you. Well, the, the greatest thing ever is the fact that, uh, you know, as, as the longer you own a home, the more it appreciates, your equity position grows. Mm -hmm. And on top of that, your, your, the debt that you owe on the, on the mortgage goes down because someone pays it for you. And I, I too, I'm a big fan <laughs> of rental properties over men. For sure. Um, I hope so. I, I, I love rental Josh properties more than Josh. I was waiting for it. <laughs> you, you, you did it a little bit later in the segment, but I was waiting for you. But Chong, that sounds all well and good, but what do then people need to look out for in order to avoid any pitfalls? Well, the first thing you need to do is make sure your numbers are right. And by that, I mean, you know, if you have a, you know, you have to figure out what your mortgage is going to be and then figure mm -hmm. out what you're going to earn over on top of it to get the ca positive cash flow. The other thing you have to factor in is, hey, there's a possibility um, that you may not have a, a renter that's going to pay their rent certain mm -hmm. months. So you have to factor all that in. And most importantly, I think that a lot of people getting into it, investors getting into it, should understand that's not their thing. A lot of times they have their, their real daytime thing, um, and then right. they have the rental property investment thing. So sometimes I say I would, I would definitely hire someone like, like Jackie to manage a property for you. That's the most important piece Especially of it. if it's not nearby. Yeah, I mean, Especially. if you have a house in Baltimore and you live in Rockville, you don't want to be driving to Baltimore no. every weekend. I mean, I did it for 10 years. Yeah. Now I have a property manager. I never go down yeah. there. And I still get my rent checks every month. Josh and I are going to start a new, uh, new uh, soap opera. Oh goodness! It's gonna be called the real. Women. Oh goodness! It's gonna be called the real and the deal. <laughs> the real and the deal. And it's gonna star Kristen. Oh, I can see a star soap opera. There we go. An amazing Give cast. Us your Are you soap guys? Soap opera stare. Yeah. <laughs> Outstanding. Awesome. I always wanted to do that. To be on a soap opera. <laughs> Where's Victoria? Where'd she go? Yeah. Okay, back to what we were talking about. Um, Josh. Yes. You have to have all your ducks in a row if you're going to do this, right? Yes. Make sure everything. When you're you know, going a to lot settlement. of people go to sell their properties and they have tax liens and stuff, and they don't want to contact the person who they owe the money to because they don't mm -hmm. want them to know that they're selling their property. So, you know, one of the important things is you got to let the guy know if you're going to try to negotiate the deal because you can't go to settlement and have an outstanding judgment. Mm -hmm. And you know that happens a lot in Baltimore on rental happens properties. Great, they get. What environmental liens and oh, yeah. all this stuff, mm -hmm. and then you go to settlement, and the people didn't know about it, and they don't want to contact the city because the city won't negotiate. But you just got to contact them, and they'll negotiate with you. Sounds well, like fun, <laughs> right? But that could be even 
less fun on the back yeah. end if you don't. Guys, thank you so much. Jackie, so nice thank to you. have you here. Rental properties, positive for you. Just make sure you're paying attention. Know if it's right for you. For more information about our amazing Real Deal team, go to therealdealdmv.com. Call 240-422-8871. Call now, fun. get free advice and real estate tips. Plus, you can join us live right here on Great Day Washington to share your experience. We would love to have you.